Good morning, buddy. Good morning. Yeah! <laughs> what up, guys, and welcome back to another one. No, oh, are you ready, Freddy Rico, huh? It is a big day for old Frederick. Today is the first day that he is gonna hunt with an electric collar on. Oh yeah. And not only that, today's video is actually sponsored by DT Systems, y'all. DT Systems makes high quality dog products just like these electric collars. E-collars, call them what you want. This is the uh, Master Retriever 1100 and let me tell you what, it is an absolute unit. Me and Fred have been practicing with it. We've got him uh, collar conditioned to a point, you know, he knows the nick, he knows the vibrate. So, this... Uh, this unit does have a vibration mode, which is something that's really nice. You don't have to nick him. You don't have to hit him every time. If you just need to get his attention, you hit that vibrate button and he goes, oh, I better listen to dad and I better get back to him or I better do what he says. So y'all have requested that we get a collar for Fred. Today is the day that we try it in the field on a hunt for the first time. But I want to give a huge shout out again to DT Systems for sponsoring this video. They actually didn't just sponsor this video. They have entirely and all, here Fred, sponsored old Frederick. Yeah, buddy, you're sponsored, man. Isn't that cool? Yeah, it's, it's very true. My dog is sponsored. <laughs> now, if you guys want to check out any of the DT systems, just like the collar old Fred will be wearing, even Storm, Wade's dog, the little black girl, she's sporting one of these bad boys now too, and Wade loves it. We've already put them to the test, we've already put them through the trials, and let me tell you what, they are a beautiful little unit, let me tell you what. Here is uh, the receiver that it comes with. You can actually program three different collars and control three different collars and dogs off one receiver, y'all. It's got a continuous, a nick, and a vibrate. And it's got a power level right here that goes from Z, well what, it goes from 1 to 15, so you can get it hot if you need to, but I don't think we'll ever need to go that hot. But today is a little goose hunt that we're going to use it on. Today we're going hunting with my buddy Andy the farmer, one of his good buddies, and Andy's dad. We're going to put up both A-frames. Well, Frederick, uh, you're looking comfy already, dude. It is time to work. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, let's get on the road here, guys. If you guys want to check out the DT systems, like I said, I will link them down in the description below. Not only do they have dog collar products, they have bumpers, they have dummy launchers, they have everything you need for dog obedience, dog training, dog care. I'm telling you. Thank you, DT systems, for reaching out to not only me, but to old Frederick McGee. So we're on the way to the field and I have a couple things to share with you. First off, in one of the last videos, uh, y'all remember me saying that Fred got out of the uh, fence? Yeah, he's, uh, he's just a young stud muffin who wants to chase his nose for them women. You know what I'm saying? And I don't think it's going to get any better. I'm going to uh, take him to the, uh, to the vet and get a chip put in him. I should have done that a long time ago. But is there something that you guys know of like a tracker, you know, like a tracking device on a collar or a, uh, a different chip that you can insert in your dog? Maybe that'll just let me see where he is at all times, you know, and instead of just when he gets lost and when he gets returned to the pound. Uh, if you guys know of any good idea, obviously a collar and tag, we got that. Um, but not only a chip but something else that might be just as good to always keep track of him i wish i could pull out my phone when he does get out of the fence if he gets out of the fence ever again and just literally see where he is that would be nice right oh freddy sit sit are you ready buddy check it out sit got the old got the old collar on him here oh yeah you're rigged up buddy are you ready for the challenge it's a challenge that he's going to have to accept because uh, it's for his own good. We got a collar on him finally. This is going to sharpen him up. It's going to keep him in line. It's going to help me control him instead of shouting all the time like a, like a you know what. But I want to show you the spread. Look at that beautiful sunrise. Isn't it gorgeous? I love me a good old Kansas sunrise. But here it is. Here's the spread. Uh, three of us today, we put up roughly... 
uh, probably 30 dozen silos and about 10 dozen socks. All of them Canada Goose decoys. I got my flags out here yet again to add some motion. I think I got seven of them black flags out. And what we did is we made a long thick line. Over on the right side over here it's thick because the wind's coming straight this way. So this is the hole that I am almost positive the birds are gonna wanna land up in. We have two hole options. We have that one and we have this one. And back there, that's where we're sitting in the evergreened A-frame. Business as usual, nothing, uh, nothing too sporadic, nothing too spontaneous. It's gonna look really good. I think the wind today is gonna be out of the northwest roughly at 10 to 12 mile an hour. I hope it hits 10 mile an hour. If it does, uh, that would be great. Fixing the spread a little bit. We're gonna get sat down. We're gonna run old Fred with the e-collar. Awesome. Howdy boys, howdy. You still nervous about being on quote TV? Yes sir. This ain't TV, it's YouTube, son. This would be Michael's Your brother friend, knows. my brother-in-law's um, good friend. Yeah. Well, Best yeah. friend. so long story short, we got a new guy in the blind today. He's a graduate from OSU. I hope that you, you graduated right. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> all honors. So shout out to all the uh, OSU folks out there. OSU, not OU, right? No, OSU. <laughs> By golly goodness, here comes some geese. Are you ready? Oh shoot. Oh shucks. <laughs> Dag nab it. Dag Look at them. Oh, Are they they're coming? coming. They're yes. coming. Oh, they're, they're coming, coming, boys. They're <laughs> coming. Are you ready, Frederick? Huh? Are you? We're just going to pull up, boys, and we're going to shoot them right in the beak. No clucking yet, guys. I'm not, I'm not calling yet. We're just waiting to see what these birds are going to do. Huh? The one, the one looks interested. If he gives it, oh, he's still coming. I'm definitely not going to call. Yeah, come on. Give it up. Sit down. Get ready. Oh. Come on. Oh, come over the top. Mm, yep, shoot him up top. Go. Oh, I missed my third shot. Dogged oh. on it. Fred, good boy. Here, dead that, bird. That one, that one should have been dead. Yeah. Yeah, he's still hurt. Good boy. Come on, uh, buddy. Let's go. That was fun. Yeah. Little rodeo up top. Good boy. Come on, buddy. Look at Frederick. He's loving life. Come on, bud. Let's go. Come on. Sit. Good. Give. We, we nailed that one. Yeah. <laughs> he, that, that front one got smoked. Yeah, he, well, he has no band on the first bird down, Freddie. We got another bird down we need to go get. Come on, Fred. Come on, come on, come on. We got birds coming. Yeah, I was cranked backwards. Yeah, I didn't even shoot. That. Oh, you didn't I, shoot? I'm nervous, guys. I'm nervous, guys. Here, Fred. Here, here. I'll shoot them over the top like that. Yeah. Right. I ain't scared. All right. All right. I ain't. Don't be scared. <laughs> you got it. You just pull that trigger, son. What are you thinking, Fred? What are you thinking? Oh, you want another bird, huh? Another group on the way, buddy. Don't worry. Two birds down. Uh, we got a group right in front here. Come on now. Get ready, boys. Get ready. Shoot him right there. Yes. Bam! Nice. Yep. What did we kill? Two or three? Got two. Got two. Got two. Nice. Nice, nice shooting, nice boys. Shooting. Right. Dead bird! Look at it out there. Let's go, Fred. Here! Good boy! Come on, Fred! What I thought. Yeah, they were a little, they're little farther out. Here. They banked pretty they quick. Pretty hard. Good boy! Come on. Here, here, here. Set. No band on him either, boys. Good job, buddy. Set. Set. Good job, Fred. Well, if y'all are liking the video, uh, that was a little farther shot than I wanted. That was a good 35 yarder. They banked on us pretty, pretty quickly. We got birds coming. They're everywhere. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up button for us. Come on now. There's so many. I don't know if Colin will even help. Holy smokes. Look at this group. Sit, Fred. Sit down. Holy. Come on now. Sit. Sit. 
good. Look at these ones getting low up top. We're gonna have to let them work a while, I bet. If they bank out and get away from us, I'll cluck at them a couple times. That moderate, that moderate clucking really did it. Yep, here they come. Here's a low group. Get ready, boys. We'll, we'll splatter this group here if they do it. Look at this. <laughs> right out front. See what? They're coming on this side, boys. Left side, landing. Oh my God. You just want to let them work? Look at them all landing on the left side. They're all landing. Dude, this is awesome. You want to shoot these? Right here, right here. Yep, yep. Let's let them come back around. Oh my God. Look at them landing. Dude. Loving it. Look at these out front. Dude. Now be careful shooting guys, just pick a couple birds, yes. don't splatter everything. These out front, if they circle on us, just, when we shoot, pick a bird that gets off the ground and down him. We got birds in, look at these three landing, four, five, oh my. Dude. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh boys. Oh yeah, look at this one, he's close. You want to shoot him? Yeah, shoot him. Oh. I only had two shells in. Cool. I only had two shells in too. What an idiot. Maybe I had three. Maybe I shot three times. I don't know. <laughs> Good boy, Fred. Good boy. Yeah, Fred. Boy, that was that was dirty. Come on, let's go. That's a bigger lesser there. Good boy, sit. Sit. Sit down. They're coming over again, Bobby. Get ready, boys, out front. Sit, Fred. Get ready. Get ready. Yep. Yeah. Shoot them. Oh, get him. Can we shoot that? Nope, one? nope. Yeah. yeah, the dog. Right. The dog. I'm out of. Fred got out there too soon. You little stink. Come on, Fred. Time. Good boy. Sit. Sit. Well, Fred got loose on me that time, but he's been pretty good. Should I try? Shooting? Yeah, shoot him if you want. Get him, boys. Oh, got one. Whoa. Holy smokes! Fred, let's go. Dead bird. Dead bird. Shoot him, shoot him. We're good. Fred, dead bird. Dead bird. All right, well, that got interesting, boys. <laughs> Woo! It got western real quick. Oh, Fred ran him down. Good boy, here. Let's go. Yeah. Good lord, that got wild. Uh, what'd you think? Not bad. Not bad, boys, not bad. <laughs> that was the last time you hunted? Four years ago. Four, four years, years ago? ago? Goose hunting. The last time he hunted four years ago. Hunting You're geese. done spoiled now, yeah, son. I know. You can't go public hunting. You can't go, you can't, you know what I mean? Uh, oh, this feels good, Andy. This is a juicy, yeah, it is. juicy nice. hole right here. Nice. You, you want to video him or do you want to do this? We're good, you, you guys are gonna, okay. yep. You guys are gonna shoot. Doing? These, these two low ones are going to be your shot. Go. Shoot them. Nice, boys. Yeah. Good shooting. That was awesome. Dude, We're that was beautiful shooting. Woo, they wadded them up. I didn't shoot that time. They did great. Fred, let's go. I've had to hit Fred uh, with the collar one time. Good. Come on, buddy. Look at him loving life, though. Oh, Frederick. You're doing good. Set, set. Set. Nope. Set. Set. Give. Fred. He's doing awesome. Guys, smash that thumbs up button for Fred. He's doing amazing. This collar, it's shaping him up. I've had to hit him one time. He's on. Good boy. Here's a double retrieve. Good boy. Let's go. Good baby. That's my dude. That's our boy. He's doing great with the old collar on today. Doing awesome, man. 
Hmm, they didn't like that. Uh, these two look really nice. If they would come right over, see these two coming at you? Come on, swing. We might have to try to shoot. That, see that single that's getting away from them? Oh God, look at this. You're gonna pull up, you're gonna shoot one. That's all we need. Oh, come on over. These are gonna go over. Ooh, Ooh we could have smacked one right there, yeah. boys. Yeah, we, we could have done it right it. there. Okay, over the top, right here. Shoot them, shoot them, shoot them. One of them. Nice! nice. There nice it is! shot, dude! There it is! That dude. was perfect! That was awesome! Dude! Oh, yes. Woo! Dude, love it. Heck of a I shot, love dude. It. We are limited out. There, we're done. What time is it, Andy? Yep, yeah. Woo! Fred, yeah. good boy, man. Now that's a good boy right there. That's a good dog. Woo! Doggy. Well, Andy's dad, uh, he hasn't shown up yet. Uh, we were expecting him to. We set the spread for him. We're like, just come and get in the blind. But well, we're limited out. Andy's on the phone with him going, Dad, if you want to shoot a limit, you need to get here right now because the birds are flying and we're done. Uh, three man limit. What time did he say it was? 752. 752. That's uh, we've had one bird to shoot for about 20 minutes, so it was hot action, boys. And Fred, he really shaped up today. That collar, I'm telling you what, this DT Systems collar, it's beautiful. I put it on vibrate after I nicked him one time, and he's just doing great. But we're gonna sit here and watch birds and uh, just enjoy the morning here. You did bring coffee, didn't you? That a boy, hook it up. I'm a guy's guy and a man's man. Oh, <laughs> look at these birds. The Holy smokes. Well, there's a snow in there. Oh my. <laughs> oh boys, this is beautiful. Holy smoke. <laughs> oh. oh my. Oh jeez. Yep, no calling. Look at those babies. The camera's fully out just filming them and they don't care. Oh boy. Look at that. Feet down, head down. <laughs> Set, Fred. Yeah, that is one good boy right there. Look at him steady. We got birds landing in the spread. He's watching them and he is not moving. <laughs> he is a good boy. Good job, Fred. Well, poor Fred has literally just <laughs> sat here and watched oh these birds. Oh <laughs> Check it out. They are landing. There's a ton out here land that's landed. Awesome. This is awesome. Old Fred, man. He's just waiting. Look at him. He's like, Dad, just Look. say my name so I can go. <laughs> Look, at, <laughs> Look at this single right here. Beautiful. <laughs> they're all going to land right there. Look at this. What? Fred is just over here whining. Well, I had to bust out the camera. There's every bit of, uh, check out all them birds. There's well over a thousand geese in the field now. Probably, it's gonna be, it's gonna, it's gonna be getting close to uh, 2,000 sitting next to us here real soon. Literally, uh, so we've been, we've been limited out for uh, I don't know 30 minutes, 30 minutes just watching this and they we didn't bump these birds out of here and uh, They're loving it. So what's awesome is we're gonna be able to come back here Maybe this weekend with Andy and hunt it again. You know what I'm saying? This is the way to do it limit out early on them early birds that give it up the singles the doubles, you know So you can sit back drink your free coffee <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, look right above us. All specs and yep. snows. specs and snows now this is wild 
Old Frederick, though. He's just getting a show over here. He's loving it. Well, another uh, 15 minutes later from the last time I picked up the camera. Nothing's changed. Check it out. Massive group just doing it. There is uh, every bit of 2,000 birds in this field now, y'all. Every bit of it. Good man. Oh, what are you doing, Fred? Get out of there, boy. Here we go. Yummy little three-man limit of lessers. No snows, no specks. Uh, a lot of snows and specks showed up while all of them were landing to the side of us, but uh, they all lifted. They're going back to water, and it's time to pick up. back here at the house uh, all wrapped up got the trailer all squared away that was a good hunt y'all that was beautiful not only was the hunt beautiful uh, but the show afterwards we got limited out before all those birds came so we got to see them land we got to watch them feed we didn't bother them we actually uh, snuck out of the blind walked out of the field didn't even scare them up got in the trucks waited for a little bit until they started trickling off by themselves and then we pulled in behind them and loaded up so that field is still good for another hunt y'all i mean that field could be hunted tomorrow and you would do another limit on it i guarantee it but this is uh the old pride and joy of today this little guy this little guy right here hi freddy rico hi buddy all right come on Freddy. come on i'm proud of him man i am proud of that dog he did amazing for his first full hunt with a collar on. Now, I think I uh, I nicked him twice, but the vibrating, the vibrating function of this collar is really gonna be awesome once Fred really learns. Go on, buddy, go on, get you a drink. Look at him, he's thirsty, he's gone. That boy gone. He's like, I need a drink, Dad. Uh, we're gonna get Fred seasoned up. We're gonna get him collar trained. I guarantee you a handful more of hunts and some work at home with that collar He's gonna be golden, and I mean golden. But I wanted to go ahead and show you guys, check it out. They sent all sorts of different bumpers, floatable bumpers, different colored bumpers. Look at this bumper here, pretty sweet, yep. And this bad boy. Woo, we got us a brand new dummy launcher, boys. Oh, Frederick, you're gonna be having some fun in the summertime with that. Seriously, big shout out to DT Systems for sponsoring Frederick, I mean, Dog, you are sponsored, man. That's wild. They didn't sponsor me. They sponsored Fred. And it's awesome because this is going to be awesome off-season training for Fred. Now I have all the tools I need. I don't have to ask you guys what I need. You guys were telling me I needed one of these about six months ago. So, again, DT Systems. If you want to check them out, I will link all of these products down in the description below. They have everything you need for all your dog training essentials. Everything you need. But honestly, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Y'all have been telling me I need to get a collar on this dog forever. Be sure to smash that thumbs up button if you did enjoy this video. And if you have any training ideas, any training videos during the hunts that you want me to do with Fred with any of these products, let me know. Any video ideas at all that y'all want to see, just drop a comment down below and let me know. But be sure to subscribe, guys. We're coming at you guys with hunting videos all hunting season long. Hit that little notification bell down there because it will notify you right on your mobile device when your boy does upload. But until next time. Peace.